average anywhere between 13 and 20,000 inspections each year out in the field for uh, the Department of Pesticide Regulation. Multiple inspections that we can do in a day when it comes to pesticides and worker protection. When I'm doing a headquarters inspection, I do look for the AA and A9 series. Um, it does have to be in the language that the employee understands. To become PCA, there's education requirements, so you need at least 42 units of selected units to go take your test and be approved by DPR to take your test. <laughs> resources in bilingual resources. One of our very popular is in your folder are uh, don't mean English with English washing so I talk to the commissioners, let them know what the community's uh, concerns are. For example, uh, somebody complained about a, a drift uh, near their home. Uh, always uh, looking for the goals of the um, people of the agriculture workers in the and are trying to better the situation. So we then started focusing on the alfalfa fields and we noticed in the Tracy area that a lot of the farmers were actually hit these ponds. The, the water was leaking through the bottom of the ponds and into the groundwater. Once we know what's in the air, uh, what type of concentration there is, we want to assess if there's any potential exposures. So these are the top three pesticide types that are involved in home exposures. Um, insecticides. If children get into these, they accidentally spray themselves in the face. DTSC's data management system is for tracking our cleanup, permitting, enforcement, investigation efforts. And we track hazardous waste facilities and sites with no contamination.